Alright everyone, so today I'm going to show you how to turn a perfectly uh, functional running copy of Mac OS X <clears throat> and subsequently any Mac into a brick. So there you go, that's my Mac OS X version right there, 10.4.10. .10. You know, specs as always. And just for the fun of it, let's just see how many files reside on my hard drive as of now. And for this, I'm using the uh, the stock hard drive that came with my uh, MacBook. So I swapped out the 120 that I normally have, and I put back in the stock hard drive that I have. Okay. So click on Mac HD, and as you can see down here, we have a nice even number of 138,000 files that we're going to have fun with today. Okay. So here's how we do this. Quit this, quit this. Uh, we're going to restart the computer. And we're going to go into Unix mode here. Okay. And in order to go into Unix mode, right after you hear the bong, go down Command S. This will bring you up uh, into what's known as single user mode. Okay and who you are right here. So you go into single user mode, it's going to bring up the nice uh, verbal uh, boot up. And this is root devices mounted as read only. If you want to make modifications to files, do that. Okay. Alright. So let me just uh, get set up right here and I'll be back. Alright. So here we are in the uh, single user mode of uh, the Mac OS 10 Unix. And uh, it's just going to, whenever you boot into single user mode, it's going to give you a very plain prompt. You're going to be logged in as root. So, here's what we do. Now, first, I'm actually going to show you what time this is, just so you get an idea of to how long this is going to take, okay? So, to find out the, the time, in Unix, the command is date, D-A-T-E, press enter, and it shows you that I'm going to begin this process at about 342, 343, okay? Now, you don't want to do this, but I'm just going to show you anyways, to show you exactly what happens when you do. The command you want to type in to erase an entire computer on Mac OS X, or for that matter, any Unix or Unix, is sudo sudo space rm space dash r f space and then forward slash okay I'm gonna press the enter key and I've never done this before because I know how bad it is so we're just gonna see what happens here okay now what this command does um, and, um, you know, you may have heard about it, joked around, maybe your IT guy or whatever jokes around it. What this is doing right now is it's erasing every file on my hard drive. Now, sudo space rm space dash rf space forward slash. Uh, let's go through that very carefully. Um, sudo is the, uh, is basically the it's like super user do I think that's what the Unix command means or it has something to do with super user and what that allows you to do is to allow you as root and root is basically the administrator or the administrative resource on any Unix Linux Pulse 6 operating system RM stands for remove okay and then you have the uh, command line options dash R and F R means recursive, which means it's going to wipe out every single file from that given directory that you begin with. So in other words, if you start at the very top of the hard drive, then um, it's going to delete every file going uh, from the top all the way to the bottom. It's going to delete everything. If you're in your home directory and you do this RF command, it'll delete every file in your home directory, so on and so forth. 
F means to basically ignore file permissions and it's good, that deletes uh, a file regardless of uh, ownership on the permissions of the file. So be that the computer, if the computer owns the file, if you own the file, if something else owns the file, it's just going to delete it. It doesn't care. And we have forward slash and that just basically means uh, start at the very top of your hard drive, go all the way down and delete everything. So this is the command that's going to break your system. And I'm just showing you uh, just because for educational purposes only, you know. So all you got to do, sudo space rm space dash rf space forward slash. And uh, as you can see, wow, it's already done. So we're just going to see what happens now. And I'm going to try and force to reboot. So in Unix or at least in OS 10 Unix, you just type in reboot and it should be reboot um, yeah well I might have to do this the hard way okay so I'm just gonna turn off my MacBook I'm just gonna hold down the button okay Turn it back on. And we're just going to see what happens now. And wouldn't you know it? No operating system. Flashing folder. So that's the brief, quick way to uh, wipe out any Mac, or Unix, or Linux. Pseudo space RM space dash rf space slash and that's what's going to happen well hope you enjoyed it have a good day everyone